Hey fashion people, Joe from Amber Creative coming at you with a fun self-branded multimedia this week. The Amber Orchid Hoodie, the brainchild of multiple minds. Here's creative director Jeremy Picker with more on self-branding awareness. One thing we've always found hard is to design for ourselves, but we constantly preach the importance of self-branding. So the last couple years, we've wanted to lead with our own creative versus always designing for other people. So we started this project and sometimes we'll base it around an idea, but this time we based it around a garment. Lane 7 came out with their vintage orchid. I knew we had to do something with that garment. So we started with with a garment and then from there we put some concepts together as you'll see in the design card we have we took some of the influences of the orchid color scheme and then some trending design styles that we really liked in the marketplace the more people can see what you lead with and how you can create what you're talking about the more credibility and the opportunities that you're gonna have we found out a long time ago, we used to tell people, hey, try this, try that, without actually doing it ourselves. So once we started producing merch for ourselves, then people can see what we're talking about. We're showing them what we're talking about, and then other people will be like, hey, can you do something like that to me? This project was really fun, and we're super excited how it came out. Thanks, Jeremy. We can start the assembly process with each small puzzle piece of inspiration. Lane 7 produced a unique pigment dyed color in this case and offered it with one of our favorite hoodies. Since graphic design is a big part of our project scope, we wanted to create an attitude based theme portraying our design vision and how we saw our brand worn in a retail setting. Let's see if art director Angelo Montiel can help us learn more about this process. So I went around the retail market and kind of looked at pieces and see what other brands were doing with, with that same type of style. I found some, some really cool sprays, marker, graffiti style, and all kinds of graphic elements that I wanted to use for our own design. From there, I went to Sketch or iPad in this case. I started doing a bunch of little drawings and kind of playing with layouts and, and different techniques. I even did some some hand uh, painting and sketching and then scanned it at, at a high resolution. It brought it into Photoshop to kind of play around, uh, therefore having this mix of digital and analog. And that's kind of what I live for, just the mixture of different elements. I always like watching those sketch process videos come to life. Here's a look at the stitch file animation progress laid over the image of the screen print. We knew we wanted more dimension at this point, but we didn't want to over design this either. We talked about applique and decided direct embroidery was the best option. We also discussed designing specifically so the embroidery and screen print weren't directly registered in a fast paced production environment. We anticipated this anomaly and explicitly designed for it. As an embroidery and design expert, I helped the team with several options displaying embroidery techniques and texture. We used multiple pass whip stitches and chunky bean stitches to help outline and accent several elements of this design. We wanted the design to look vintage and handmade, but also modern and cutting edge. Our preferred screen print ink formula comprises a plastisol mixture of clear chino base with black ink for the dark tonal and white ink for the light tonal. We do this to keep the hand soft while maintaining a slight tonal hue the garment color provides. Lastly, our featured oversized HD woven neck labels are hand sewn on all four sides with an added folded woven size label at the bottom. Private labeling is one of the best ways to establish and maintain your branding equity. Please hit like and subscribe to help support the channel. Have a great rest of your day and fashion to the people.